Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I have a Target fall clothing haul. I wanted to show you what I bought from Target for my new fall wardrobe. So if you'd like to see what I bought, then please keep watching. When going through my fall wardrobe, I noticed that I really didn't have anything left because I had done a massive closet KonMari declutter in my closet a few months ago. And if you haven't seen that video, I will link it here for you, here or here for you so that you can watch it. I also have it in the description box below if you want to click on that link. But I did get rid of um, about two thirds of my closet and a lot of it was just really old things that really didn't fit me anymore, that I was holding on for sentimental reasons and they were just taking up space. So that was last year and this year when it's starting to get cooler weather, I realized I don't have sweaters, I don't have long sleeve t-shirts, that sort of thing. Now I have been going through my drawers and I am working on a second KonMari on the things that are in my drawers so that will be coming up soon. Make sure that your notification bell is on for that so that you don't miss that. So I've had to start replacing things um, just everyday fall clothing that easy to wear, um, easy for mom life and just still cute. So I did pick up a few items and I will show you what I get and then at the end I will be doing a try on. The first thing that I got is this really adorable um, sweater. <laughs> it's kind of crop. Um, it is obviously yellow. It says 1978 on here and it is 1999 and it is by Grayson Threads. And I just thought that this was adorable with some jeans. I love on the side it has that white stripe. I like the soft yellow color for fall. I think it's gorgeous. So yeah, that's my first item. My second sweater is this cute hoodie. Um, it's kind of loose on the sides, which I thought was really cute. It has on the arms, it has little flags, it has all like different flags from different nations. And I thought it was just adorable. Um, it's a little bit sporty. It says sport on it. So I don't know. I just thought that this was super cute for everyday wear. Just a quick throw on on here. I don't know. I just thought that this was really cute. The next sweater that I got is this animal print. I'm so excited animal print is back in fashion. I have gone through like three cycles of animal print being back in fashion. So I am super excited. I feel like it goes with everything. It's so easy to match. You can wear black with it. You can wear brown, you can wear beige, you can wear any color really. Jeans look amazing with animal print. This is coming up on the camera looking more gray than it is. It's really kind of a beige taupey color. So um, I love this detail on the sleeve where you've got kind of like more of the beige and then also on the bottom. Um, it's got kind of a looser fit on the, on the side so it's not that fitted. Hopefully when I try it on it doesn't come off as fitted. But yeah, I really thought this was cute. This is cute with sneakers. This will be cute with boots um, later on also as a transition piece into winter. Um, I just thought that this was adorable, so I had to pick it up. It was $19.99. I will have the links for all these things in the description box below. The next sweater that I got is this loose, um, I don't even know how to explain it. It's from Wild Fable. Oh, the animal print sweater is from A New Day, and I got it in the size medium, just so that it could be a little bit looser. I didn't want it too snug. Um, this one is Wild Fable. I got this in the size small because it looked kind of loose. Um, it has that really adorable tie in the middle, kind of like an accent, and um, it's longer in the back. So it has extra garment in the back to kind of cover up, especially if I'm going to wear these with leggings. I think it would be super cute. Um, it's kind of wide under the arms, and then it's um, just regular long sleeve. Nothing really special there, but I just thought that this was adorable. It's loose fitting, it looks super comfy, and I thought this would be really easy to match up with kind of anything. The only thing I'm worried about is hopefully it's not too see-through, so I'd have to see what I have to wear under it, but I will try this on and show you guys, and you can tell me what you think. And the next things that I got are bottoms. So this is from Universal Thread. Now I've never really gotten 
jeans from Target before. So you guys let me know in the comments below whether or not they're any good. I'm hoping that it does. It says smooths and sculpts. That would be great. Engineered with perfect fabric weight to smooth and sculpt throughout the day. This is a mid-rise jegging. I got this in the size two, which is a 26 waist, and it's a regular length. Fitted hip and thigh, slimmest leg, smooths and sculpts. So it's kind of a dark jean. It looks brighter in the camera, but it is a darker jean. Maybe when I try it on in different lighting, um, you'll see the actual color. It has the distressed knee, which I thought was adorable on both sides. It's not too much. Um, I think it's just the right amount. And then the bottoms also have the distressed look right there. So I was really excited about this. I think it will go with almost everything that I got. It has that kind of distressed look too um, around the hips. So that one hopefully will be super cute on. The next two things I got are leggings. So I got this in the small. Um, I don't know how to explain what the fabric The fabric is soft. It's like a cotton, you know, stretchy cotton, but it has a thick waistband around the top. Let me see if I can get closer, if I can show you what it looks like. It's kind of ribbed and it's really thick on the top. Um, hopefully that means that it is, will hold in the belly. So this is seamless legging cotton blend high waisted by a new day. These were $18. So Hopefully they're good quality. If they are, I will keep them. If not, then, you know, I might have to exchange them or something. So yeah, I got these. I thought these would be super cute with so many things. I actually don't own a pair of gray leggings. Um, so I was happy to find these. And then these are the Moto leggings. Do you guys know what Moto is? I don't know what Moto leggings are. It says wide waistband, and it's also by a new day in a small. And these were, $18 and they are also high waisted. Let's see if I can open this. <clears throat> so the detailing on this is super cute too. It has um, some detail right there on the thighs and then again on the it's like a shimmery, it's not leather, it's not faux leather. It's really soft material and then it has more of the detailing throughout the rest of the leg. So it's the knees that have just the plain um, fabric on it and then over the thigh is where it's kind of ruched, I guess. I don't know, we'll see how this looks on. Hopefully it's super cute because I thought this would be even cute with the animal print. I thought that this would be super cute together for you know, kind of a funkier outfit. So. I am going to see what all of this looks like on. So we're going to go try everything on and then you guys tell me in the comments below what you think. All right, so this is the first outfit. This is the crop yellow sweater that has the striping on the side right here. It says 1978. I paired it with the jeans. And these were the jeggings, not jeans actually. And you can see where the distressing is. It's not too much, actually not much at all. It's really, really cute. You can see it kind of at the bottom, they're a little long on me. They are the regular length. Um, I am 5'4", so I am forever trying to find the right length <laughs> in leggings and jeans. But um, here's the back, the pockets are nice and big. They're just like, I think they're nicely placed. Um, tight not too tight they are high-waisted i maybe could have gone for one size smaller but then again maybe that would have been too tight but there is definitely room so if you're a size four you might still be able to wear the size two um and you would have room we'll see if these stretch out as i wear them throughout the day but for a quick outfit in the morning i think that this is really easy and still cute and fall like I did put on my um, little flower tennies with them. So that is the first outfit. So this is my second outfit. This is that loose sweater that had the long, longer back. And these are the gray leggings. Where have these been all my life? They're like a thick cotton, 
So they don't feel cheap. They're um, pretty grabby, which is nice. They have a tighter um, band at the ankle, I guess, to hold them up. And they are high-waisted, so you can see here. Um, very smoothing. Look at the profile. Very smoothing here. I don't know if I would wear it necessarily with this sweater, but um, I think these are super cute. Just, I'm trying to get the back. I can't use my other camera because it's too heavy and I don't have the right lens. So um, I'm using my phone for this. I wonder how it would look untied. Well, now it just looks like a mess. But still, kind of cute. I mean, if I were to straighten that out, you know, and maybe just have one side tucked in and then let this one just be free and out like that. It's wrinkly now though, because of the top. I really like this in the back, the length in the back. Um, it's not see-through at all. I was happy about that. I think it's just so cute and snuggly as a sweater. Definitely something I would wear. I just don't know if I would wear it with leggings that are this tight. Maybe with jeans would be better. Maybe I'm being too self-conscious. I don't know, let me tie this again. All right, so I tied it up again. So I'm pairing it with these beige flats that I got that were also from Target. They usually have them beginning of spring and through the summer. If I find them, I will link them for you in the description box below. I think they will go with so many things. Super easy to wear, super comfortable. They're kind of a knockoff for Tom's. I think so, with that are like a fraction of the price. So it's what I paired them with. But easily, easily as it gets warmer, beige um, boots would be amazing, I think, with these leggings. So yeah, it's the sweater and the leggings. Look, together. is the sporty hoodie that I picked up along with the jeggings and my Roxy tennis shoes. And I think that this is the easiest outfit of all. It's a cute hoodie. I paired it with my fall um, tan bag. This is a leather type material with some gold detail here, ton of pockets. It has zips on the side. It has a back zipper pocket. And it also has a divider inside. I will link this. This is an Amazon purchase, but this will be pretty much what I'm carrying all fall because I feel like it matches with everything. But yeah, I will link this in the description box below if you want to pick it up. It is so cheap. Um, wouldn't tell though by carrying it, I think. I think it still looks kind of nice. So um, I will link that for you because I think this is ideal for any fall wardrobe. Also spring and summer. I mean, I think it can go with anything. But yeah, this is... The other outfit it's cr a little bit shorter but i don't think that this is a crop it's just nice because it kind of covers the belly but it's not super long spot at the top here for a ponytail or for a bun right here that you can pull through right here which i thought is adorable never had that before in my hood but um i will definitely try it and see what it looks like yeah that's this outfit super easy super comfy I could see myself going to soccer games in this. I could see myself doing errands in this. Um, the material of the sweater, it's kind of, it's thinner. It's got that terry type material. Um, so it's not gonna cause you to overheat or sweat or anything. It's just really comfortable, really soft, um, super easy. Like I'm telling you for those soccer weekends, this is perfect. This is next outfit. I kept on the leggings just so that you could see how it would look with jeans. And see here, I think it looks a bit more to true color in this lighting as the darker. And you can kind of see the um, faded distressed around the hip. This is the animal print sweater. How adorable is this? I am in love. It is so cozy. I'm glad that I got one size up. If you guys are gonna get this, get one size up. Um, but I love the sleeves. They're a little bit long, super cute, just really cute and simple around the neckline. Um, again, I put it with my fall bag and I wore my beige slides with these, but I think this is so cute. This is the easiest thing to put on and still look put together with some jewelry. I think you could have like a really easy, easy 
well put together okay, look. And now with the animal print sweater, I put on the moto leggings. Tell me what you guys think about these. I'm not that sure. This has that detailing on the thigh, the knee, and then the thigh. They're a little bit loose. They're not like a snug, tight fitting legging. The material is a little loose and stretchy. Um, but I did put this on just to see for like a night out, you know, maybe dinner, movie, that sort of thing, how it would look. I did put it on my Nine West suede heels with them in brown. What do you guys think? I'm not quite sure. I haven't decided on that, but I still love the sweater. I think the sweater is super cute. I would still wear that tan bag with it. I could also wear a black leather bag with it. I have a really cute one. If you guys wanna see a, my bag collection, leave me a comment um, below and I would be happy to give you one of those. Yeah, so that's these leggings. Yeah, tell me what you right, think. Guys, so that was everything that I purchased from Target for my new fall wardrobe. Let me know in the comment section below which ones you liked, which ones I should return, if I should keep everything. I thought some of the items were really cute, easy to wear, easy to mix and match, and I think I can mix some of them with things that I already have. So yeah, leave me comments below. The links to all of the pieces will be in the description box below, and a link to the purse that I mentioned from Amazon will be down there too. I think you should get it. I think it's so easy to wear. If I can't find that exact one, I will post um, a similar one for you because it's like my everyday purse now. It's easy, I can throw it around, I don't worry about it, and it still looks good. All right guys, hope that you enjoyed this video. If you're new to my channel, I would love it if you subscribed and stuck around and click the like button for me guys. If you like fall shopping hauls and try-ons, I hope that you do. This is my first one making, so let me know how you like it, and I will see you all in the next video. Bye.